The two Trinidadians who've been awarded the Queen's Young Leader Award have spoken with CNews about work they've done in their communities. Winners of the prestigious award will receive a unique package of training, mentoring and networking including a one-week residential program in the UK during which they'll collect their award from Her Majesty the Queen. Here's Dion Batiste. Trinidadians are among those selected as recipients of the 2017 Queen's Young Leaders Award. When the announcement was made on Wednesday, Sidel Ramkisun and Matthew Batson were listed among the Commonwealth winners. In her telephone interview with CNews on Thursday morning, Sidel Ramkisun, whose interest in social work was sparked on a trip to Jamaica where he worked with the friendly able children teaching them about art, said he is honored to have been chosen. It really is one of those times that you, have, you don't know what to say. It's really very indescribable and surreal. It just happens and you're like is actually happening um, but at the same time uh, it, a lot of hard work f for myself from a lot of other people went into it and um, you know it'll give me a platform to further what I want to do and really help young people in Trinidad. Mr. Ramkasun plans to use the platform to further empower youth in Trinidad and Tobago. He says young people should be more involved in major decision-making processes. I think right now that young people, they try to get included and people try to include them, but when it comes down to the nitty-gritty of it, they're not actually properly included in decision-making processes. And I just, I think like winning the award and the fact that we have two award winners this year, both young people, um, it really shows that young people have the ability to, you know, make a difference and make decisions and do very great things. The 22-year-old founded and is now the president and director of the Overall Youth Empowerment Action, an NGO which engages in youth advocacy and volunteer programs. When contacted for comment, Matthew Batson also expressed his excitement at being selected. I feel overwhelmed. I think it's, it's an amazing opportunity. Um, I think would be the work that we have been doing is being recognized and I'm very happy to be given this opportunity to represent the work that we've all done. I'm also working on creating a youth-led, youth-generated magazine um, and I'm hoping that the Queen's Young Leaders Award will help me make connections and meet people who can help put that forward, not just as a magazine for Trinidad and Tobago, but for the, the region as a whole. Theo Kadav was the 2015 recipient of the same award. Dion Batiste, C News.